G'day guys, Robbo here again. Welcome to another food video. In this video, I've been just across the road in Tarmore, New South Wales to Fat Boys Kebabs. And I've got myself a lamb kebab with a lot. And uh, which, when, it, when I say the lot, it's uh, lettuce, onion, cheese, tomato, tabbouleh, and lamb. And I've never had a lamb kebab before. Because none of the other, <clears throat> as far as I know, none of the other kebab shops in the area do lamb. None of the ones I've been to anyway. So I'm going to try my first lamb kebab. I did have the lamb in the mixed snack pack the other day. And it tasted good. But I'm wondering how it's going to go in a kebab. It looks like the, uh, the bread on this kebab's cooked nicely. So let's get into it. Mm. That's good. I really like that. I should also say I got um, barbecue sauce. Now, one other, one other thing, I'm going to get you guys to tell me in the comments why, why is the lamb kebab one dollar more than the chicken or beef kebab. Sixteen dollars for this. The other ones are fifteen dollars. So let me know in the comments why you think that is. I'm not going to complain about that. That's it's only an extra dollar, and lamb tastes nice. And lamb seems to be a a special meat to the Aussies. Always gets promoted on Australia Day. <coughs> so I'm not going to complain too much. It tastes really good. You get heaps of meat in this too. It's jam packed. Absolutely chockers. Yeah. The salad goes well with the lamb, it's really nice in the sauce. And as I said, the uh, just by looking at it, you can see that the bread's cooked nicely, and it tastes nice, nice and soft. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna eat all this on camera. So I'll have a couple more bites and then we'll get into the review. Quite enjoying this though, so I'm gonna scoff the rest of this after the video is finished. I just don't want this to be too long of a video for you. Hmm. So I must say, I've got one piece of meat in my mouth right now that's uh, a bit chewy. Got a bit of fat in it. That's alright. Except I find it hard to chew when it's got too much fat in it. So I'm just going to pop off camera for a second and get rid of that piece of meat out of my mouth. Yeah, the 
just when it's when it's too fatty and chewy I find it hard to swallow so yeah anyway that's my issue I've ha always had problems with chewy meat it's no fault of the kebab shop so I won't mark them down on that so I have one more bite That's so good. So, size and the price, absolutely chock a block full of um, lamb. Heaps of salad, nice salad, fresh salad. Uh, the sauce is nice. Yeah, I can't fault this, it's getting a 10 out of 10, just like the other ones did. Size and the price. And the taste, yeah, size, price and taste all around, getting a 10 out of 10 again. I'm not going to mark them down for the extra dollar. But you guys can de debate that in the comments if you want to. I, I really enjoyed this kebab. And I am going to finish it off camera. So, um, as I've said in the last couple of videos, guys. <coughs> um, I'm going to be cutting back on uh, videos. You'll still see videos from me. But I'm going to cut back on videos now. After this one. Unless something really awesome comes up. That I just have to review tomorrow. We'll see what happens. Uh... But yeah, um, okay, so you may have noticed I stopped the video in a hurry. My nose is trying to run away on me as usual. So I didn't want you to see that on camera. Um, but yeah, if you guys like the video, give it a thumbs up and share out the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If we get to 900 subscribers by the 10th of August, I am going to do a food challenge at the place I'm going to when I go on my little adventure. And um, what else? Um, share out the video and send a super thanks if you'd like to support future food videos whenever I do them. And, and become a member to help support future food videos as well. Six, uh, $5.99 a month will get you some perks on the channel. And also, uh, if you want to, uh, completely up to you guys what support you give me financially but uh, <clears throat> you can if you send me a <clears throat> I've got to save up money as I've said to uh, save up for this holiday as well so maybe when you send a super thanks let me know if you're helping me out with food videos or if you're gonna help me out with paying for this holiday I'm going on um, but uh, I'll see you guys again fairly soon I do have a couple of other video ideas that don't involve food coming out soon. So, uh, you'll see those eventually. And uh, it's mainly the food videos that cost me the money, so, yeah. Um, but I'm going to head off now, guys. Catch us in the next one. Bye for now.